everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Molly and we're doing a little like life update kind of video. I'm sorry if you can hear the heat. It's a little chilly outside today. It's only 50 degrees. I'm gonna go back up to 70 this week. Don't worry, but I'm just kind of like chilling out. I have an appointment at 12 So I got like 15 minutes like not even to do this little video, which is perfect That gives me a time limit. We're gonna give you guys a little update I wrote down a couple points like to talk about there's like something in my eye So I'm sorry if it's like watering. That's why I thought I'd do this video in my car because I don't know I just don't do a lot of like car stuff anymore because I did in my car for a while here so now I do. I feel like it's fun to do a little Q&A up here. Not Q&A, just kind of like everything that's been happening, why I've been so like busy, just everything. And I have some big news too. But I'm right by the church right now so you can hear the bells because it's 11.45, they're so pretty. Okay, they're done. I think I'm gonna start off here. How's that going? I was really gonna explain like what I'm doing next year, like how this is, what, how it's going right now. So for a while I wasn't really in much because I joined the team in October just because I was really missing a tier and I needed something. So I obviously wasn't in much. They weren't gonna put me in everything right away because obviously I just joined the team. Um, I wasn't gonna take over someone's spot like that. We actually had practice last night and I'm actually glad I waited to film this video till today because I'm actually now in all the stunts, trolley tour. Um, I'm actually in all the stunts as of last night and today is February 8th. We had someone that is no longer on our team that was a back spot so they had to move some stuff around and I'm backing. I'm actually really liking it again because for a while I was just kind of, it was really fun because all the people are so great. I love like having like, cheer friends are always my best friends so I loved being able to go there and have friends because school friends are, it's like different here. I don't know. I just am very 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 happy that I'm like cheering again like cheering cheering because I really missed like the hard the hardcore like cheer if that makes sense like I miss EC so much so 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 much I miss everyone there and I just miss just like all of it everything about it like the actual sport itself I miss the atmosphere all of it so I'm actually really glad I'm back into like some of the routine now because it's still not too much too hard of a stunt but it's like something so I'm excited that I actually get to do more physical activity because I'm just excited I really like it that's kind of what I was getting to Next, I'll talk about oh plans for next year. So I don't think I'm gonna actually cheer cheer myself next year. I want to try to coach. I want to see if they want any if they need any help coaching because I feel like that's such a good job for me. And I'm hoping I can coach. That's like my thoughts right now. If not, I'll get a job somewhere else, especially over the summer because I'll be here, which gets me into school. So school is going absolutely wonderful. Like school, school. I'm doing great in my classes. I think SCAD is a great school for people that love being creative and have great time management and put effort into projects and things like that because that's how I am. I had really great time management coming into here because I just learned that from my schools before and I've done so much like working with that so I now am just very used to having like the school atmosphere or like the time like putting a lot of work into your projects and having to space that out and like I joined cheer so I could be busier because I had too much free time. A lot of people aren't in that situation situation because they can't really manage their time as well which is just a skill you have to learn but like thankfully I learned that from a really 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 young age like I'm talking like I learned that in like elementary school how to time management so I've been doing great and if anything like I probably could take a fourth class and be fine but I'm doing great my grades are very very good I mean I love I'm just like loving like school school I'm loving my classes I just registered for my spring and summer quarters this morning actually and yeah I'm very excited because I'm also gonna be here all summer long and that brings me into the fact that we have an apartment oh my god I'm so excited about that but I am doing summer classes because I'm taking I have two months so I'm majoring in business of beauty and fragrance and minoring in industrial design and also social strategy to do that I'm gonna have to take at least nine extra classes not at least I'm gonna have to take nine extra classes that are not in my major or minor usually it's it would be ten for five for each but one of them does overlap but nine of them don't so that means I need to work those into my schedule somehow so there's a lot of free electives in places to take them however I'm also gonna do summer quarters if I want to because I also want to do internships over the summers so I'm gonna probably have to do summer quarter this year possibly next year so that's like how it's happening i'm very 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 excited to be here all summer i'm definitely gonna have so many like family friends come down this summer i already know i'm planning a trip for sarah and sammy to come down i'm so excited probably for my birthday weekend because my birthday is actually on a friday this year and if you know scad doesn't have classes on fridays i'm very 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 excited that we can possibly do something for they might come down for like a week but the reason we are planning it already is because i signed a lease on my apartment i'm so excited i'm living with allison and reese so you guys haven't met Reese yet, but you know Allison. So I'm so, so excited for this place. These people like just stopped right here. How convenient for me. I'm starting to like shop for stuff. We haven't picked our like rooms in the house yet. We're trying to visit again this week. And I tried to vlog last week and I didn't like love the stuff because I didn't really get a lot. And I can't really show the place until we move in because people living in it now until we move in on June 1st, like they're living there till May 31st. So that's when they have to move out. So I'm so excited to move in there. Like so excited. It's beautiful. Everything about it is perfect. You're gonna get so, so so many
many moving vlogs and everything like that because I move in June 1st. My classes end June 2nd. So like I'm gonna have like a couple days to like get myself out of the dorm. So I'll have like between like June 1st and June like 3rd or 4th-ish to from my dorm to the apartment, which I'm so excited. I literally can't wait to do. And then I'm driving back home in my car and then staying home for two weeks and then driving back and then summer starts. So that kind of what's happening. I'm so excited, literally so excited. Yeah, I'm really excited for this summer. I'm so excited to live with Allison and Reese. We're gonna have so much fun. I can't wait for it all. So I'm so thankful that we found the place we did and I'm so thankful that I that we are all able to do this. So yes, that's the whole gist about the apartment. Like I said, I'm doing summer classes and everything. I just booked my classes for spring and summer. Taking mostly foundation classes. I am taking one beauty class in the spring. I'm very exciting about that. I think it's like history of beauty or something like that. Cannot wait. Okay, also I thought I'd like tell you guys like how I've been physically doing. Like right now I'm waiting for my appointment at my therapist because that's what I've been starting. I started it last week, but we're just gonna like start doing weekly things just because I have a hard time managing like stress and like I guess it's anxiety. That's what we've kind of figured it out as. So I'm just trying to deal with it all. I've just been very overwhelmed. I'm not even, I don't know what because I'm good at time management with school. So I don't know what it is, but yeah, that's pretty much what's happening with me. I'm doing a lot better now. It was just like a weird week or two that I had like a hard time like with a lot of stuff. So that's what I'm gonna say. I'm gonna have to head in in a minute. Oh, I've definitely been keeping so busy. I need to stay busy or else like I can't function. Like I need to be busy, but I also need like my rest days. So like I always go to bed early. I, I've been loving reading lately. I've been very distracted by TikTok a lot, which I need to get better at. Those are like all my random updates too, but that's like everything. I hope you guys like this little update and it helped. I'm about to go to my appointment, so I thought I'd just do that. It was really, really, really short video. I'm probably not gonna have to cut out a lot of talking, and so yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I have so many videos planned, so I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye, guys. The sunrise.